Dhammapada verse 17 Daivadatta Vatu Ida Tapati Pecha Tapati Papakari Upayata Tapati Papang Me Katanti Tapati Bio Tapati Dukatinga Seventeen, here he is tormented, hereafter he is tormented, the evil doer is tormented in both existences, he is tormented and he, and he laments, evil have I done. He is even more tormented when he is reborn in one of the lower worlds, Arpaya. The story of David Datta, while residing at the Chaitavana Monastery in Savati, the Buddha uttered verse 17 with reference to David Datta. David Datta was at one time residing with the Buddha in Kusambi. While staying there, he realized that the Buddha was receiving much respect and honor, as well as offering. He envied the Buddha and aspired to head the order of the bhikkhus. One day, while the Buddha was preaching at the Veluvana monastery in Rajagaha, he approached the Buddha and on the ground that the Buddha was getting old, he suggested that the order be entrusted to his care. And the Buddha rejected his offer and rebuked him, saying that he was a swallower other people's spittle. The Buddha then asked the Sangha to carry out an act of proclamation, Prakasanya Karma, regarding Devadatta. Devadatta felt aggrieved and vowed vengeance against the Buddha. Three times he attempted to kill the Buddha, first by employing some archers, Second, by climbing up the Gijakuta hill and rolling down a big piece of rock onto the Buddha. And thirdly, by causing the elephant Nalagiri to attack the Buddha. The hired assassins returned after being established in Sotapati fruition without harming the Buddha. The big piece of rock rolled down by Devadatta at the big toe of the Buddha just a little. And when the Nalagiri elephant rushed at the Buddha, it was made docile by the Buddha. Thus Devadatta failed to kill the Buddha. And then he tried another tactic. He tried to break up the order of the bhikkhus by taking away some newly admitted bhikkhus with him to Gaya Sisa. However, most of them were brought back by Terra Sariputta and Terra Mahamogalana. Later, Devadatta fell ill. He had been ill for nine months when he asked his pupils to take him to the Buddha and subsequently made the trip to the Jaitavana monastery. Hearing that Devadatta was coming, the Buddha told his disciples that Devadatta would never get the opportunity to see him. When Devadatta and his party reached the pond in the Jaitavana monastery compound, the carriers put down the couch on the bank of the pond and went to take a bath. Devadatta also rose from his couch and placed both his feet on the ground. Immediately his feet sank into the earth and he was gradually swallowed up. Devadatta did not have the opportunity to see the Buddha because of the wicked deeds he had done to the Buddha. After his death he was reborn in Avicii Niraya, a place of intense and continuous torment. Then the Buddha spoke in verse as follows, 17. He is tormented. Hereafter he is tormented, 
evil door is tormented in both existences. He is tormented in the elements. Evil have I done. He is even more tormented when he is reborn in one of the lower worlds, a pyre. 